so welcome back to the vlog um i'll show you my outfit i'm just wearing this oatmeal kind of zip up hoodie some flare pants that's pretty much it i've just got a clip in my hair i haven't even brushed my hair yet but um i'm starting the vlog here I did my book review vlog, that's why my bookshelf is messy because I decided not to put all the books away last night. Um, so pretty much I don't know really what we're going to be doing today. My friends have been playing a lot of online video games, so have I. Um, so I think I'm going to do some of that and when it stops raining I'll show you guys progress on the garden outside. So looking at it now this is our veggie patches. So we've got chop choy over here which is doing really well like these are massive like that's as big as my hand that whole leaf. We've got celery in the middle here which kind of got disrupted. A couple of little weeds we don't need. This is strong spinach all the way up the end here. We've got some lettuce at the back. I don't know what kind. I think it's romaine or fancy lettuce. I've got some onions that I propagated just in the middle here. Over here we've got beetroot. All these tiny little seedlings are starting to sprout. I've got chives or shallots I can't remember we have zucchini we've got four of those they're huge and I've got some tomatoes here and some tomatoes here I need to do some weeding around here but yeah so it's looking pretty good and some of these lettuces are like kind of red tinged like that one instead of being super bright as you can see, the cat has chomped on some of these. So it's looking pretty good. Um, so I'm hoping to harvest these soon and make some ramen. That would be great. Like I love fresh pak choy in ramen I just feel like is a game changer then over there we've got curry plant kefir lime rosemary down there and then just over here this tiny little guy is our new curry plant and it's tiny like it's so small but it's so good now I had one of those in middle school and it was like the best thing. So hopefully all of our little seedlings will grow up nice and strong and obviously it's been raining for the last couple of days so hopefully they've all put their roots down and they'll be all good soon like this one looks a bit not in there. Um, yeah, so we only did this garden bed two days ago on a dry day. So it's all fresh soil and everything. And this one, this actually used to be two garden beds. But I um, took them, because it's double height here. I took one from over there and put it over here and we've just laid all these papers down so it's not muddy.
Laguna Beach cap. It's this kind of soft corduroy I've got on. I've changed my earrings now because I'm going to a concert tonight, which hopefully will be in this vlog. I've got this black tank top. I've just got a cute little teal colored bra underneath. I've got these jeans on, which are my only pair of non-ripped jeans. And then for shoes, I've got on my Nike low courts. They're kind of like a high top, but a little different. So I've got those. on the way to the Black Veil Brides concert. Um, I've done my makeup as you can see. I didn't do anything with my hair like usual. Um, so I'll insert some footage now. ago I have not tried any of them on because it's winter here in Australia um yeah so I'll show them to you guys so the first one I've got I got it from City Beach it's this cute little hibiscus and monstera leaf two-piece and the bikini top on it is a bit different to what I normally wear. It's like a halter neck strap around the back type of thing. So I'm gonna try that one. So I've got the first bikini on. It's a bit, I don't know, it's kind of weird because it's all one strap around the back. Like it's not adjustable at all. But it's around the back it's not very supportive um, here are the bikini bottoms they're kind of cute they're a bit skimpy at the back legs I would give it well I mean I love the pattern so I would give it I'd say like a four out of ten because I love the pattern. I also put my hair up in this cute little flower clip. I normally have it out like this or something. But I would give it a 4 out of 10 because it doesn't fit well. Well, the top doesn't fit well. But the bikini bottoms, love them, great. The top I love the idea of, but I don't love the execution, like how it sits. The next one I've got is this burnt orange bikini. It's a three piece. It has two tops. So one of them is like an underwire bra sort of a one. And the other ones are more traditional triangle style like this. And it just comes with some orange bikini bottoms to match. I really love the color of this one and the material. If you can see it's like 
silky, it's shiny, and I just thought the colour was so great. I couldn't walk past it. I think it was like $25 for all three pieces. The thing I'm trying on is this orange triangle type bikini. I don't love the top of this one. I don't know what it is, but it's not like it's digging in. If you can see, digging into my back, but it goes up at the back. The cups aren't like the right size, I would say. Like, I mean, this is a large. I mean, I could adjust the straps at the back. It's got like adjustable straps, but I feel like they would dig into my shoulders a lot and the cups aren't big enough. I feel like, you know, if I'm gonna play beach volleyball or something, they're not the greatest. I would say it's all right for like lounging and stuff like that. I would not ever go like swimming, like a race to swim or something with it. Definitely not. And I would not um, like play any beach games or anything in this top. This one, however, I would play some games in. I would like play some beach volleyball. Definitely could go swimming in it. The straps are thicker around the back and around the bottom here, like around there. The, bo the bottoms are just as skinny as the last pair. So, like, I don't mind a bit, but they're not like too out of this world. This top, I would give a 9 out of 10. The only thing that could be better is maybe a little bit more coverage in the front, like a little bit of a wider um, cup. The last one, I would give it maybe a 2 out of 10. I would say I'm a harsh critic. I know exactly what I want in a bikini top and that is not it from the last one. This one I'm trying is actually, I bought it online. It's from Fashion Nova, which I have never shot from them before, but now I think I might. So it's, it's like, um, it's this really high-waisted bikini set. Like it's so high-waisted. It's ridiculous. And it's a bandeau style top that goes around like that and it has detachable sleeves so it's got these little little clips on it and I just thought it was so cute because I wanted some high-rise bottoms like those ones um, I thought oh if I don't like the top it doesn't really matter because it wasn't that expensive I actually love the little sleeves and the bandeau top on it, so I'm gonna try those. So I think by far this is my favorite bikini that I've tried on so far. It's different. I never wear um, bandeau bikinis. I always have straps, so this would be great for tanning. Fake, 
fake bamboo ring in the middle, which I wouldn't usually go for because I don't really like that sort of stuff. But I wasn't intending to actually love the top of this one. I was buying it for the bottoms, which in turn is like I think the best thing I've ever done is buy this bikini. So. 10 out of 10 for this one. And with that last one, I'm also going to try with the same bikini bottoms, this black bra style bikini as well, um, because I haven't tried that one before. silky it's kind of ribbed if you can see that so it's a kind of ribbed material once again love it I'd love if it was just a little bit wider maybe like a centimeter that way would be great I'm just wearing it with the same black bikini bottoms but I think it's great. Um, I would definitely say this one is more supportive than the orange one for some reason, even though I bought them from the same place and at the same time, like it's not another production, but I mean, it is a different material, so maybe it is. Um, so I think that's pretty much it. I would say my favorite bikini is the these bottoms black bottoms with the black bando top with the sleeves on I just feel like it's a whole resort look in a cheap bikini now if you were on my if you follow my Instagram I actually posted it on there maybe a week or two ago when I first got it and that was when I first tried it on so I knew I was gonna like it for this video um, other than that I think that's it